Hello, uh, I'm Paula Pasquale and I'm going to quickly go through three different um, kind of new products um, that they are uh, launched from Cezex. Um, the, I'm going to start with the oldest one that it does was released, I think, about a year or so ago, and is the magnetic platform. Now, these substitute the multi-purpose platform tab 2. It means that this is for framelets and you just need on top two clear plates. I'm going to demonstrate after how, exactly how you do it. The other new product, and this is just a few months old, it's about, it's been launched now in the shops, is a precision base plate. This has got a metal plate, basically, and that you are cutting against it. So you will get a much crisper cut with this, with the very intricate um, dies, framelets, and also you will be able to cut certain materials that you before you couldn't. And the third um, item that I'm gonna just quickly demo is gonna be the dye brush uh, release with the foam mat. Right, so, um, just gonna show you the magnetic mat. And for this, you are gonna just need the two cutting plates, as you can see, my cutting plates are well used and uh, they still work very well. Now, there are very strong magnets here, so you can see how it kind of goes into it. It moves always together, all right? So I'm just gonna put it in there. I'm using my Big Shot Plus, which means that it's the nine inches. However, these platforms and these um, cutting plates are the big shot standard one which means that are six inches so you can account for that the big shots all of them are meant to work with each other so you can use and um, what i mean by that is you can use the platforms from one machine to the other as long obviously that it will fit through so the big shot standard will work on the plus and the plus will work also on the pro but right so we take it and it has cut perfectly so this is my preferred platform when i'm cutting um framelits that are especially framelits which are the ones that are open in the side so i can see exactly where it is going to go and it usually you know it stays put much better than any standard way now the precision precision one um as everything with Sizzix comes with the explanation on one side, but this is not the cutting plate. The cutting plate is the other side, the metal one. This is plastic and paper. This is metal and you are cutting against that. Now, this substitutes one of them. They have got, um, I think, pretty much exactly the same thickness. So you take one of them away and you still keep it. Now, for um, speed purposes demo, I'm gonna use that one. You don't need to use the magnetic because what it does, it tags to it, but it makes, you know, the magnetic doesn't transfer. This is a die that I love by Tim Holtz. It has a lot of intricate detail. So I'm just gonna put it in there. As you can see now, it's moving around, around because even though I have the magnetic mat underneath, it doesn't transfer the magnetic because I have got a metal plate. So just gonna go through it. And uh, by the way, my little station is on wheels, that's why it moves, but the machine is stable within the unit. So now when I take it away, I can see that it has cut really nicely. This is the best way to make sure that all the lines are cut. Now, to release it, this is what I love about this product, is you can just go like that on the mat to make sure that all the bits, the big bits are there. But more importantly, the dye is clean because this is the most important thing. The dye needs to be clean from all these little pieces in order to get the best cut the next time. Many times we leave tiny bits and pieces inside it and that not, it doesn't damage, but it makes it much harder to cut it. I hope this was helpful. Thank you for watching. Bye.